Look at this awesome thing. So Dinwiddie made me a custom side shovel holder. This thing's amazing. Boom, it's all fancy. It's dirty money. Now let's see if it'll dig some treasure. So, <laughs> Dinwiddie and I were just cruising around trying to find an old site. We're in a clearing that has kind of a man-made pond by it. And this is the middle of the mountain. Looks like somebody burned a goat here. Well, maybe not burned it. Uh, but look at that, there's a, looks like a dead goat head. It's a weird thing to see out here. So we found this weird pit. <laughs> We're not sure what's up with it. It's like lined with spiky sticks. I don't know. Is it an old well? Is it like a, a trap? Like a deadfall trap? Now, right next to that, I'm in this really big hole that looks dug out. And there's some wood in the hole. Some old beams. Ah, we gotta be close to something. Well, I think we finally honed in on something. I mean, this isn't fantastic, but that's definitely a piece of suspender. And all of a sudden we're seeing some, some tin laying around. It's in here somewhere. We're gonna find this home site. Dang, Dinwiddie got himself a sheep tag. If it was COVID. That's cool, man. All right, we're finding some stuff. A little horse tack. And right over here, by this tree, there's a wood-burning stove, so I think we're close to something. Man, those rivets get you every time. That sounds like a deep silver coin. The old hook of some kind. That's gonna be a tobacco can. All right, there's definitely stuff going on here. There's some other iron things I haven't shown you. Just trying to dig them to see kind of what's going on. And I got something real old right here. Not sure what it is exactly. Dang. I don't know. Old piece of equipment. Pretty neat. Yeah, I got her flipped over. Some sort of old piece of farm equipment, it looks like. Made a wheel out of this. <laughs> Dang. Never know what you're gonna find in the woods. <laughs> yeah, it looks like they beat that into there. Wonder where they were making. It's gotta be some sort of homemade jobby. So I think we might have found the home site. There's like a big berm right here. But look what's right on there. If it was only complete. What does it say? Hops. Well, there's the big, I guess, cellar hole. Or maybe it was a house over a cellar hole. Yep. Man, that took some some work. You wouldn't know it by the camera, but we covered probably a good quarter mile, half mile here. We are in a totally different clearing not far from here. Thinking that's where it was going to be. And it's hidden up here in the sticks. Nice. I don't know, some sort of little valve. Well, I'm doing pretty good on the relics. There's a neat little valve. Well, I'll say this, this site's got some weird stuff. 
Well, Good then would he found a nice little pocket, yeah. eh? Ooh. It's got something on the scale there. Look at that, it's got me a brass buckle. That's a start. Dang, now that's a big piece of leather there. Crazy. Well, I'll tell you what, I don't know if you can see what we're dealing with here, but we are fighting some of the worst brush I've ever been in. Just trying to get signals. That's kind of neat. Well, there's a big brass buckle. A little horseshoe. Huh. <laughs> well, that's a big old lantern part. Dang, that's a cool wrench than what he just found. That's way cool. <coughs> then what he got himself a couple of nice <laughs> stove legs. Look at those things. <laughs> And an ink well. It's cracked, but it's at least it's whole. That's awesome. It is pretty cool. Well, I found six more of these wheel rims. That's a score for me. I like to make little end tables and stuff out of them. Little epoxy projects. But, yeah, I don't know. That was a weird hunt. We didn't really get any tokens or coins, buttons. Only got one suspender clip. Got a lot of interesting things, but it's just brutal in there. That's so hairy, and there's just tin and roof and nails everywhere. So I'm sure we'll be back, but uh, I'm gonna need a break from that site. <laughs> Anyways, hope you enjoyed it. See you on the next one.